Number 1. Themis UGV The Tracked Hybrid Modular Infantry System, or Themis for short, is the first hybrid fully modular unmanned ground vehicle in the world. Themis is a multi-mission, unmanned ground vehicle being developed by Estonia-based defense and security services provider Milrem, with support from Estonian Ministry of Defense. The UGV is designed to carry out a variety of military duties in hazardous or difficult-to-reach locations. The Themis UGV is based on tracked chassis with two crawler tracks connected by a large central bay. The Themis multipurpose infantry system can be armed with a variety of weapons such as anti-tank missiles, machine guns, and remote control weapon stations to engage light armored vehicles. The vehicle's length and width are both 2.1 meters while its height is 0.98 meters. The UGV has a curb weight of 850 kilograms and a payload capacity of 750 kilograms. By putting battlefighters at a safe distance from enemy attack, it improves their safety and operational effectiveness. Number 2. PD-100 Black Hornet FLIR Systems PD-100 Black Hornet is a small unmanned aerial vehicle. Armed forces can use the Black Hornet UAV to spy on prospective threats. The small remote-controlled rotorcraft aids in the rescue of soldiers on the front lines. The Black Hornet has a top speed of 10 meters per second. It can last up to 25 minutes on a single charge. In mission-critical operations, the Black Hornet provides intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance assistance to military forces. The UAV allows access to remote sites and provides tactical situational information. A steerable electro-optic camera is fitted aboard the Black Hornet, which can provide still pictures as well as live videos that can be viewed on handheld devices. The base station controls can be used to zoom in on the camera for a better image. Number 3. GuardBot GuardBot is an amphibious monitoring robot, which can roll on snow, sand, and dirt in any terrain. It has two cameras, microphones, and GPS, and may be controlled remotely or through satellites. GuardBot may be used in future military operations according to the military. GuardBot is a surveillance robot that can maneuver on any terrain and even swim. The device is available in several sizes, ranging from 5 inches in diameter to 7 feet in diameter. GuardBot's equipped with two surveillance cameras, a 25-hour battery, microphones, and GPS, allowing it to be operated remotely as well as via satellites. It's currently still in development, and the military are looking into using it for future deployments. Number 4. TICAD TICAD, the innovative U.S. military octocopter drone with an installed low-left firearm and advanced stability technology, is introduced by Duke Robotics, a leader in robotics technology and drone solutions. TICAD has an unparalleled lightweight robotic gimbal for carrying and stabilizing payload recoil up to three times its weight. Through integration of an air support system into combat missions, TICAD advances military strategy. Without intrusive action, the UAS drone can engage with troops or lead accurate strikes. Moreover, TICAD offers 6 DOF degree of freedom in real time, a feature which gives the US and its allies an advantage in the fight. In various military applications, TICAD may be deployed, including enforcement of border patrols, drone warfare, and anti-terrorist measures. Number 5. DOGO The DOGO robot is a little robot with a 9mm Glock pistol as a weapon. In the field, it's your robotic watchdog. Using a simple and easy operator control unit, the Dogo robot gives your team live video reconnaissance and the option to neutralize threats remotely. For SWAT and special operations teams, law enforcement agencies, and first responders, the Dogo robot is the ultimate robot. The Dogo robot's controlled by the Ranger RCU, a point-and-shoot interface that allows to designate the weapon towards a target simply by touching the target as it appears on the screen. The Dogo robot is compatible with small pistols such as Glock 26 and Sig Sauer P320SC and has secure 2.4 GHz wireless communication. Number 6. Sea Wasp Saab developed the Sea Wasp remotely operated vehicle to combat underwater improvised explosive devices. For ordnance disposal, the ROV offers a cost effective and safe underwater alternative. It can detect, locate, and neutralize IEDs hidden in confined spaces, such as ports and harbors. The Sea Wasp ROV is based on the commercial Saab CI ROV line. The vessel's modular design allows it to be customized to fulfill mission-specific requirements. 
A truck, generator, pilot station, hand winch, and power supply unit make up the entire system. The vehicle's 1.7 meters long, 0.5 meters broad, and 0.4 meters tall, and it weighs about 90 kilograms. Six brushless motors drive the six thrusters of the Sea Wasp counter IED vehicle. The propulsion system propels the ROV at up to 2.5 speeds, allowing it to maneuver safely during launch and retrieval. Number 7. Rheinmetall AUGV Mission Master Rheinmetall Canada designed and built the Mission Master, a modular autonomous unmanned ground vehicle, AUGV. The UGV can be utilized for reconnaissance and surveillance missions as well as to mount and dismount troops and improve operational efficiency. Rheinmetall invented the idea of unmanned multifunctional ground vehicles with the Mission Master AUGV. The Mission Master can be equipped for tactical overwatch, CBRN detection, medevac operations, and communication relay missions in addition to reconnaissance and surveillance duties. The all-terrain UGV has a length of 2.95 meters and a weight of about 750 kilograms and is based on an 808 platform. The vehicle can carry a maximum payload of 600 kilograms and up to 400 kilograms during amphibious operations. The unmanned vehicle has a top speed of 40 kilometers per hour and can be equipped with tracks or chains for added mobility. Number 8. Harris T-7 the Harris T-7 Explosive Ordnance Disposal EOD system delivers uncompromised performance for vital operations with best-in-class mobility, manipulation, and intuitive control. Harris designed the T-7 from the ground up with input from hundreds of active duty operators to meet the exacting requirements of EOD missions. The operator receives tactile input from the robot control system, which is designed to give them the dexterity of a human hand when controlling the robot arm with the remote control handle. Standard issue disruptors and weapons are compatible with the T-7. It can help with a wide range of EOD missions, including defusing IEDs. Constructed from field-proven subsystems, the T-7 is a modular design that leverages Harris's participation in the U.S. Department of Defense AEODRS IOP architecture standards to provide upgradability through common interfaces. Number 9. MUT the MUT is an unmanned 8x8 ATV that follows soldiers throughout their path, carrying their gear and allowing them to focus on the objective. The MUT features a wireless tethering mechanism that allows the vehicle to track and follow a single soldier in an infantry squad like a pack animal. The MUT unmanned ground vehicle is built to be durable, lightweight, and low cost. It comes in four different chassis configurations based on wheels and tracks, 44, 66, and 88. The MUT unmanned ground vehicle can operate in two modes teleoperation and semi-autonomous. In teleoperation mode, the teleoperator controls most UGV missions from a distance of 200 meters via line-of-sight communications. <laughs>